All right, let's take you live now to the Virginia Beach Oceanfront. The city is one step closer to hosting another music festival there. Last night, council members approved setting aside $750,000 for a sponsorship agreement with the media company Odyssey. But some voice concerns about the festival overlapping with another popular event. Brenna McIntosh joins us now live from the Oceanfront. So Brenna, you spoke to one council member who says this shouldn't be a problem. That's right. I spoke to council member Worth Remick today. He says the music festival is now set to take place south of the art show, and he says he believes both events will leave their own footprint at the oceanfront. With the return of something in the water, along with the inaugural Jack Loeb and Beach It festivals, it's been a busy year at the Virginia Beach oceanfront, and now there could be a new festival headed to the resort city this fall. We have reactivated the resort this uh, year. Councilman Worth Remick oversees District 6, which includes a portion of the oceanfront. He says he hopes a new festival this October will keep the momentum going. It's going to be a great weekend and an off season, you know, and a shoulder season. While the festival hasn't been named yet, it's set to feature pop and rock acts, something Virginia Beach resident Jason Morneau is excited to see. If it's music and live, yeah. I'll be there. But the new festival doesn't come without debate. One question that concerned council members, where to put it? At a meeting Tuesday night, some council members pointed out that the proposed weekend, October 20th to 21st, will overlap with the Mocha Boardwalk Art Show. To not even recognize that it was going to be such a conflict with the art show really gives me a lot of concern. Councilman Remick says to accommodate both events, the festival will take place from 15th to 20th streets, while the art show will be from 24th to 35th streets. In a statement, director and CEO of the Virginia MOCA, Gary Ryan, said in part, we are pleased with the decision to move the concert south of the art show footprint and look forward to more visibility for the art and the artists. Some council members also voiced concerns about parking and security with the new festival. City officials said the new festival could hold a maximum of 12,000 people. Live in Virginia Beach, Brenna McIntosh, 13 News Now. Brenna, thanks. The $750,000 that council set aside last night comes from the Tourism Investment Program.